Cheryl, it is Carrie Hope Fletcher here and the wonderful Daniela has asked me to do this video for you. So I'm sending you both so much love. Thank you so much for supporting me. I know you guys are sort of following me um, and supporting me along the way. So it really, really means the world. And I love that you're coming to London next year. Um, London is such a, I love London so much. I've lived here all my life, um, sort of on the outskirts of London, but um, I love it and I'd never want to live anywhere else. I think I'll always want to travel and go and see other places, but I'll always gravitate back to London because um, I just love it here so much. Um, things to do in London. Covent Garden will always be one of my favourite places. I really, really love it there. Um, it's got a lot of history. It feels very old. It feels very like old school London. Um, where else? Where else in London is fun? Around the Shard is really nice as well. I love anywhere along the river. The South Bank is really nice. Um, there's lots of like fun like stalls and stuff that are set up along the South Bank at the weekends. Um, and of course, I will always encourage you to go and see as many shows as you possibly can because they're all incredible. Um, but Edinburgh is also beautiful, as mentioned in your message. I love it there. That's another place that feels ancient. Um, and Manchester is also wonderful. Birmingham is wonderful. There's so many places that are phenomenal. Um, but Bath will always be a favourite place of mine. That is where Jane Austen was from. Um, and it's just so, so beautiful there. And it feels um, like the perfect place to go for afternoon tea. Bath is great. Um, but yes, thank you so much for supporting me and sending me all the love. It means the world. Um, and jokes and accidents whilst on stage. The most recent one was in Cinderella. There's like a little tree stump that gets brought on that we sort of, me and Ivano sit on a lot and he like climbs over it. And it's just a sort of, thing that we interact with um and the other day we had quite a few people off and a lot of people were doing things that they'd never really done before and one of the things that got forgotten was bringing on this tree stump and even though it's just like this it's not like a talking point it's not something that is massively important but it is something that we like sit on and climb over and stuff all of a sudden when it wasn't there it was like we didn't know what to do with ourselves like all of a sudden we were like ah there's this like integral part of the scene that's just disappeared i don't know how to move now do i just stand here and cross my it was really weird like suddenly uh, i especially didn't know how to like function without this prop very strange when something like that gets taken away you don't realize how much you rely on it but anyway i'll stop rambling now thank you so much and i'm sending you both lots and lots of love and i hope to see you next year <laughs>